Hello, uh, everybody. Mountain Mark. And, uh, going for a walk in the woods. Showing you what I'm finding. Here we go. Alright. So these white little dots you see down here. Let's take a closer look. There we have something that looks kind of like a mushroom, but not quite. There's some more over here. Uh, that one's a little spongy. We're looking at abortive entoloma. And uh, another name for them is snow shrimp. Because when you cut them open, they kind of have some pink veining in between. And snow shrimp just sounds a little bit more appetizing than... Well, anything with the name aborted in it. Um, so, these guys are a uh, form of entoloma, or some argue uh, are malaria, but that's another story. Um, that It's basically a mushroom that's decided to, it started to come up and then it aborted growth. And so it just kind of turns into this billowy cloud-like, um, you know, firm when they're good. Um, and, and, and it's, it, it's a, it's a good edible mushroom. Sometimes you get them like, uh, hey, this specimen here, where they're really kind of soft, mushy. You don't want those. Throw them out. Um, but, uh, but these ones are good. You know, they're all along this path. And, um, I'm just seeing them as I'm walking along here. And, uh, you could gather plenty enough for a meal right along this road and um, um, great tasting mushroom a lot of times you'll see them on uh, wood you know big clusters of them on wood um, and uh, you know typically actually probably a little more often you'll find them on wood but but I find them a lot on the ground too and uh, some of the guidebooks will say if you see the non-abortive form growing with it then you can know that that's edible as well I'd take some caution with that advice because uh, gosh I've seen deadly poisonous mushrooms growing right alongside uh, edible ones so so always make sure you know exactly what you're eating um, but I mean these these guys are all through here and I could just pick them all day um, so that's that abortive entoloma snow shrimp um, great tasting mushroom kind of tastes like uh, I, I don't know it's 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 almost like the mushrooms you buy in the store only a lot better and um, only a tip with these guys when you think they're done cooking cook them a little bit longer uh, there's something about the texture that just really you really gotta cook them, cook them down, um, and uh, you'll really like them. I'm sure of it. Take care. Bye.